Thursday, November 16, 2017 Equity Bank's players, from left, Esther Butali, Brenda Wangi, Hilda and DEGWA and Samba Myomba pose for a photo in Luanda where the FIBA Africa Champions Cup for Women is being held. Photo FIBA Africa Equity have an uphill task of felling on form Primero de Augusto of Angola, while KPA square it out with First Bank of Nigeria. By Philip Onyango More by this author Kenyan teams KPA and Equity Bank have a date with destiny when they take on formidable opposition on Friday in their FIBA Africa Champions Cup for Women quarterfinals at Multiuso du Colomba here in Luanda, Angola. Equity have an uphill task of felling on form Primero de Augusto of Angola while KPA square it out with First Bank of Nigeria and matches scheduled to tip off at 2.45pm and 4.45pm Kenya time respectively. GSP from Algeria gave Equity Bank a lifeline to the final eight after beating Vita a club of the Democratic Republic of Congo 6,762 in a Pool A fixture. That result locked out the Congolese side from the championships and guaranteeing the Kenyan girls a fourth-place finish and automatic advancement to the knockout stages. KPA women on the other hand needed no favors despite losing 6,834 to Ferroviario of Maputo in their final Pool B match on Thursday. The Dockers did not execute well offensively and lacked consistency on defense allowing their opponents open shots. Betty Kananu scored 9 points and Celino Kumu added 8 in a losing effort in this game that saw KPA's point guard Natalie Akanyi carried off the court at halftime after colliding with Vega Veronica, an Argentine player featuring for the Mozambican club. Imitatu belonging to forward traveler Sacco, a police lorry and two pull carts were torched. NASA politician Johnston Muthama claimed eight other people suffered gunshot wounds.